Hello everybody. So today I want to show you how to answer about this one. The first thing we need to find first the derivative of the function. So that should be like this. So this is about the power rule of the derivative. So let's say we have this number in here. So I will put this one go in here. So that means we have this number and 100, 111 minus number one, we have 110. Similar for this one and this one. This one that is about the constant. So you got number zero. And now we can simplify. So we know that this one, they always provide the positive number for all the value of S belong to integers oh, sorry belong to real number similar for this one and we know that number two that is about positive so that means if we apply all of them in here, so we can see that this one that is greater than or equals to number two, and number two is greater than number zero. That means the function is always positive. So because this one they always positive, that means we don't have local. We don't have the local point in here. So that means we don't have this one. This is the end. Thank you for watching.